First time voters have come out in huge numbers this election season, but they're not that enthusiastic about the candidates. We've asked multiple people how they feel, either Donald Trump or Hillary Clinton, or even a third party candidate. I definitely say that I'm enthusiastic to be able to have the opportunity to have my voice heard, uh, my values, and who I believe in the candidate uh, for this presidential co election. Voting lesser of the two evils. Honestly, I'm heading to happy hour after this because I would have preferred if Bernie Sanders was in, but you know, if I had to choose between the two, it would be Hillary. Well, regarding this election, I'm not as excited. Like, going back to where, you know, when Obama was running, you had all this hopefulness in the community and everything. This time around, it's just kind of like, I feel like I have to do this because I have no other choice. It's not like I'm strongly enthusiastic, like, oh my God, Hillary, yes, she's the one for me. Or like, yeah, Donald Trump, you know, he got like, it's just like do or die at this point. Um, I really am. I'm enthusiastic because, you know, it's um, two elections in a row, a very historic election, the first black president, hopefully the first uh, woman elected president. So it's, I'm, I'm really excited uh, to be a part of this event. As a first-time voter, you must exercise the right to vote, no matter the candidate. May it be Hillary Clinton or Donald Trump, or even a third-party candidate. Make sure you're getting out and vote. With Howard University News Service, this is Devin Jones.